Well, you two are smart. We got another airbag thing here to blow up. So, we're going to try this old washing machine. We're going to do the spin cycle and see if it'll clean it. <laughs> and hopefully we don't have any fuck-ups this time. No bloopers. Well, so what happens when you let a you get taken airbag out. And that's the bigger size airbag. The other one was a small one because it was the driver's side. This is the passenger side, so the airbag is bigger. Yep. Yeah. You tuck it in there, real good. Redneck wiring looks good. Yep, well, that wiring looks so good. Check that one for sure. Put the shorts. No shorts. Okay. Um, <laughs> I am uncomfortably close on this one. Um, we got nowhere to go here. Okay, you hear it? Shit. What? Oh, shit. Yeah, you ready? Ready. Okay. Three, two, one. <laughs> that wasn't my open the lid. <laughs> well, these airbags are starting to get boring. Well, we had, if we would have had a microwave or something, you probably oh, it bent the fuck out of everything, though. No? <laughs> it lifted the hinges right yeah. out. Ooh, knocked that ring off. And it really buggered up the inside. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Just put the airbag though. Put the airbag. That one doesn't smell as awful. Awesome. Oh, it still stinks. But it smells like fleecy. Yeah. <laughs> so hopefully we'll, catch, we'll keep more eye out for airbags. Don't try this at home. These are hot. Yeah, yeah. On well, Dave's farm, we found out real quick those things are hot. <laughs> he grabbed it when it was no gloves and <laughs> burnt his fingers. Gloves. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All righty. Back to the mud, I guess. Back to the mud. See if we can get a truck stuck. <laughs> See if we can get a truck stuck. Okay, anyways, we'll talk to you guys later.